Hello my dear friend, welcome back. Uh, my name is David Cortez and this is my website www.david-cortez.com On my website you can find a lot of information about software engineering, web development, mathematics, physics, chemistry and so on. In this video I want to explain how to do a little C program that asks the user to type n numbers and it calculates the maximum number. So you can find the PDF on my website. And now we will do it step by step using uh, this IDE that is code blocks, uh, an open source cross-platform IDE. So let's start uh, together, create a new project, console application, next, C, project title, we call it uh, maximum dash number. A new GCT compiler, ok, finish. So we can start our, our program inside the folder sources. We need to click the main.c file and we have this. The first thing that we have to do is to delete this line. So we can start return 0 instead of return 0 we write exit underscore success so hashtag include stdio.h because we use the input output uh, library hashtag include stdlib.h because we use the standard library so we need to write uh, three, three integer variables n, i, that is equal to zero, and position, semicolon. Then uh, we have two float uh, variables, so that, is, that we call number and maximum, semicolon. Print f between parentheses, between quotation marks, we write number of numbers equals to, and at the end the semicolon, uh, scan f, so the program reads what we type, uh, between parentheses, between quotation marks, send d, because we need to read an integer ampersand n because it is a color exactly it is the address of the variable n so while we do this while loop while i while i is less than n printf print f between parentheses between quotation marks back, back slash n because it is a new line number percent d because it is the index uh, the number percent d equals so comma i plus d because it is the index uh, i plus one i plus one because uh, uh, I start from zero, but in this case we want uh, that it starts uh, from one. So scan F between parentheses, between quotation marks, percent F because we need to, write, to read a float, ampersand number, because, ampersand because it is a scalar, if uh, i is equal equal because it is a comparison we need to write between braces maximum is equal to number position is equal to i plus one 
then we write else else if else if the number is greater than maximum in braces we write maximum equal to number semicolon position is equal to i plus one so at the end we write i plus plus semicolon and then print f like the last chain maximum is equal to percent f is equal to number percent d back to the last chain position mark comma maximum comma position closing parentheses the semicolon and then we have the return exit success so we need to write a program that asks the user to type n numbers and it calculates the maximum number so we have hashtag include the, the standard input output library dot h then we have hashtag include uh, fdlib.h because it is the standard library. Uh, then we have the main function that returns an integer because the integer is this that is equivalent to zero. Uh, the exit success is, is equivalent to zero. So uh, the variables are add integers and i that is zero at the beginning and position. Then we have two float variables, number and maximum. So printf number of numbers is equal to scanf percent d and percent n, while i is less than n. Printf number percent d is equal to i plus one. Scanf percent f m percent number. If i is equal equal, so it is a comparison. Maximum is equal to is number is equal to number and position is equal to i plus one. Else if number is greater than maximum maximum is equal to number and position is equal to i plus one i plus plus so print f back relation maximum the back relation mean, mean the meaning of the back relation is that we want a new line maximum is equal to percent f because it refers to this float that is maximum is equal to number percent d because it refers to this integer that is the position semicolon return exit success okay so we can click here that is uh, build and run so it has found a pro scan f d okay scan f we need to click here another okay number of uh, numbers so we write uh, three number one minus one number two minus two number three two point one the maximum is the number point one is uh, the maximum number is two point one that is the number three okay so we can try the release is that one now number of numbers five number one minus one number two minus two number three zero 
number four is 0 0.1, number five 2.3. So the maximum is 2.3, that is the number 5, ok. So we have written a simple program uh, in C language. It is simple but it is important because by doing these exercises you learn day by day how to code in uh, C language. So I want to remember that uh, this is my website www.georgedavid-cortez.com I have created this website for me for uh, organizing uh, my, uh, my notes and uh, my exercises of my job but I have created this website also for you so you can learn for free and you can learn a lot of interesting things the software about software engineering, web development, mathematics, physics, chemistry. You can find a lot of information on my on my website. You can find also a lot of games written in JavaScript. So uh, clicking the right uh, button of your mouse, you can you can uh, you can access the source code. For example, uh, games, uh, block puzzle. Clicking the right mouse, uh, the right button of your mouse, you can uh, view the source code, and you can study, for example, the JavaScript code. So by studying all this stuff, you can build your own, your own website, you can do a lot of things. You can study your college for your college for your college exams, you can do a lot of things. You can communicate with me using this chat that I've written in PHP. So you can find uh, a lot of interesting information on my website. You can communicate also with the, an artificial intelligence that I have created. Hello, my friend. So you can ask what you want. Uh, what uh, What do you think about uh, about the meaning? Of life. I choose to make the rest of my life the best of my life. Perfect. So the AI answered, I choose to make the rest of my life the best of my life. So I have written, what do you think about the meaning of life? And the artificial intelligence that I have created, so answered in this way. Perfect. Okay, so I will copy here. Okay, perfect. So I want to remember that you can make also a donation by clicking here on the sidebar on the left. Dear friend, your donation is important. Help me update this website and join this community. So for now is everything. Thank you for watching, see you next time, bye bye!